what is going on guys and welcome back to another video it is your boy javi here bringing you another auto tech talk video so let's get into it right away because we have a lot to talk about and i want you guys to comment on it remember that we are going into the almost 10,000 subscribers it would be amazing to reach 10,000 subscribers if you guys are liking the content remember to subscribe and hit the thumbs up for your boy it definitely helps the channel a lot All right, so Chevy has officially said that the Chevrolet Malibu is coming to an end. Chevrolet announced the end of production for the Malibu as of November 2024, making the marking the conclusion of a 60 year career. Now, you have to remember that the Malibu has been around since the 60s from enjoying and sporting a V8 with 300 horsepower and up to at some point 350 horsepower. You also have to remember that Malibu was a line of the Chevelle, was the top of the line of the Chevelle. But Chevrolet has said that the decision mirrors and kind of is following the industry trend where people or the consumers are kind of favoring the SUV and crossovers more than the sedan, making the Malibu for the past decade or so, or even longer, a rental queen. You're kind of seeing them everywhere from airport rental parking lots to Hertz to anywhere you see that there's a rental place, there is a Malibu coming from a big rear wheel drive v8 300 350 horsepower to the front wheel drive four cylinder definitely making it the rental queen now riders and illustrators have definitely come up with the idea of what if gm reinvented the malibu so this would be the malibu coming back in all its glory of what it used to be because i believe it has been living in the shadows of its former self for more than a decade so this picture that we got right here was from the illustration of different riders where you see pretty much chevy dna in this picture you see big wheels you see that front shark front end nose bumper with thin leds and the big chevy logo just up front so this vehicle would be pretty much bringing back the iconic chevrolet malibu in all this in all its glory so it pretty much says what if gm reinvented the malibu as an inspirational model rather than the rental queen not only reviving it but making it a beacon of design and performance the illustration and the article pretty much talks about a powertrain that would evolve ev and plug-in hybrid together making it a rival of the tesla 3 performance in acceleration and in the long run so the ev would pretty much would be the rival to the tesla 3 and it would be a flagship version of the malibu of the camaro z01 perhaps a malibu z01 it would feature a twin uh, twin electrical motor capable of being the rival of the tesla 3 as i mentioned thanks to an 800 volt and 900 kilowatt uh odium lfp battery this setup would cater to, to the consumers looking for a substantial uh, sustainable yet more powerful driving option while saving the planet as we see from the consumers who purchase the ev and the hybrid now for those that might be not ready to make the full <clears throat> the full ev leap ev leap a plug-in hybrid could be definitely utilized as a new 2.5 liter turbocharged four-cylinder engine it's currently underdeveloped so you pair that with a motor that brings out 188 horsepower 140 kilowatt electrical motor providing a blend of fish of efficiency and performance together now you put in a position tuned steering wheel would enhance that hands that enhances the handling and adaptive dampening and you got pretty much a beast now gm has no plans on replacing the malibu directly the potential for such model does exist but this would be an illustration of bringing back the malibu to its former glory so so it doesn't live or wouldn't go out as it did kind of like a rental queen so the question is would you buy one this is the illustration here and i think it looks amazing and i think it screams out chevy dna we see a very futuristic car but yet we see some big wheels almost like the wheels that kind of like a camaro would rock or even a zero one or, or co6 would rock that thin led line in the front we see a big lip in the front with the huge bumper that shark bumper now the illustration that we are presented here that would be the future malibu the uh, world touring championship malibu kind of resembles a little bit of the tesla as you see on the door handles are kind of sunken in kind of like the tesla the back of the vehicle kind of looks like a tesla but this will be the rival to the tesla with a twin electrical motor thanks to an 800 volt architecture and 90 
kilowatts of old uh i believe that's how you say it, k kwh of otm lfp battery ensuring that the consumer who is after ev or hybrid could get you know favor from a performance vehicle so this would be something that i think gn should probably consider down down, down the line in the future if they want to give an offer of the ev and the hybrid together bringing in this powerful monster i want you guys to leave me in the comments and tell me what do you guys think of this vehicle and would you guys buy one that is the question should chevrolet keep the malibu share your views in the comments below and i'll see you guys on the next one